welcome back guys to another video and as you can see behind me the sun's out weather's warming up a little bit so we thought why not let's get back into this e33 to 5i convertible just the idea with today's video just take you for a spin with the roof off this first time i've actually seen it with the roof off as well because he had the hard top on on the actual review we did of this car on the channel uh but yeah so we thought we'd take take it out for a spin just the roof i'll go for a little cruise this thing is seriously i've driven it for about five minutes now just to here and it it attracts a lot of attention honestly attracts a lot of attention well obviously you didn't get a chance to see the roof off last time but i mean look at that that is simply stunning you know my child this this car is actually beautiful you can't like you you get taken back just by looking at it, you think wow Remember these cars from back in the days used to have a 3 to 5i motorsport convertible and you know they were they were very very good but now to see an actual tidy rare you know tidy convertible and as mentioned on the actual uh, review of this car this is a factory 3 to 5i manual uh, with the electric roof as well so which does work as well it needs a little bit of assistance every now and then but it does actually still work and the whole host of um, modifications on this car are mentioned on the actual review it's got air ride vault racing wheels and throttle bodies and stuff and uh, yeah but i mean just look at that man that is that is mega honestly mega all right what we'll do we'll go for a little drive simply just a few minute video today nothing you know that you need an interval in between so um so yeah subscribe to our youtube channel performance lifestyles we've got plenty of actually actual performance car non-performance car reviews up on there already so do feel free to check them out and um Check us out on Instagram and Facebook as well. So performance underscore lifestyles on Instagram, performance lifestyles on Facebook. You, and if you'd like your car featured on the channel, drop us an email, pflifestyle at hotmail.com and we will be more than happy to accommodate. But as I mentioned for today, we're taking this for a cruise. So check it out. So here we are, back in this epic E30 325i convertible. And as mentioned previously on the actual review of this car, this is a factory three to five and a factory manual so it's quite a rare ish sort of uh, car and especially in this day and age you just don't find a nice it's difficult sorry should i say to find a nice e30 and this is one fine example honestly this is such a beautiful car i've got a soft spot for these as i've mentioned before my first ever bm was one of these but in a motorsport convertible one of only 25 ever made in 1991 uh, I didn't have it in 91 but it was a 91 car but it was such a mega car and yeah they, they're just a car that you can just yeah just on a nice hot summer's day cruise around roof off perfect ideal recipe admittedly though I've been driving the my M4 around with the roof off obviously yeah you could tell the difference you know this is 25 years old or whatever it is you can tell the difference with the technology and the way the feel this actually feels very bare it's very open you can actually everything's here whereas the m4 actually does feel a bit a bit more enclosed and stuff but again the looks that this thing gets you, you're just not you, yeah you're not getting them in any other car this is such a beautiful car seriously to drive and again it's a it's a 2.5 they didn't really have a shed load of power from the factory anyway it was you know for, for its day it was good 170 odd brake horsepower but for 2022 it's uh, not quite enough but again saying that it's you, you're not buying one of these with the standard lump standard everything for performance runs but they've got enough power to get you out of a st sticky situation but i mean just check it man just look at this thing this thing is so so good so beautiful mashallah this car is simply stunning you can hear that them throttle bodies the moment you put your foot down like i mentioned it's only just over 200 horsepower 230 odd but that noise it makes is so good don't get me wrong if people hear it from the outside they probably think you're driving something that's going to be taking off very soon but it's not taking off the, the this an e33 to 5i is not going to be taking off but you could cruise around in style this is one of them big pimping cars from back in the days 
epic sort of car. Honestly, it's, it's, it is an amazing car. It's an enjoyable drive. You could cruise around in this thing and as long as you could be bothered with making an effort to drive it, yeah, man. I think, I think these are very good. Very, very good. Like I mentioned, it's a beautiful day and hopefully we'll get another beautiful day tomorrow. Take the M4 for a blast. But with that one, it's, uh, it's a lot easier to drive and a lot easier to accommodate. So, so I will be posting a video of that as well, hopefully next week, the week after, even though I will be videoing it tomorrow. Seeing as we've got a bit of nice weather, you don't know when it's going to change. You know, it's been up to like 20 degrees, but then you never know. Next week, it might actually be like back to fives and sixes and stuff. So make the most of it whilst you can. You can feel the scuttle shake with the roof, with that, without the hard top on. With the hard top on, it was actually very, very firm, very sturdy, very stiff. But without the hard top, you can actually feel the uh, the flex in the body, which you get on all convertibles, especially the ones of yesteryear. So car could just cruise around in smiling all day. Listen to that. And it gives you a little pop at the end of it as well. Well, we just drove past some coppers, but nothing to worry about. The car's not going very quick. Picture yourself back to 1992 and imagine if you had one of these then. You were either somebody of a very, very, you know, highly paid profession, clearly, obviously. But they, they simply weren't many people around. But then after that, obviously, they've, they've dropped in value so much, um, you know, 10, 12 years ago. But over the last couple of years, more so over the last six to months to a year, they've kind of like gone straight through the roof and these things are worth an absolute fortune now. So this is why I say to find a good example, good example in terms of cost, in terms of looks, modifications, maintenance. It's a difficult, difficult one to actually do, but unless you're paying 20 plus grand, but honestly, there's, there's not many cars out there that can match this to cruise about in for that sort of money for 15 grand on a day like this. I can't really think of any. It's one of them cars that will put a smile on your face every time you drive it, trust me. If you've not, if you've not got any love for these E30s, then you don't know what you're missing out on. Because they are simply amazing cars. And these cars have got such a good following, honestly. They were, they, an E30, a classic BMW always has a big following, but the E30 has a special place in a lot of people's hearts. And it goes to show, honestly, I look at it like myself, car enthusiast, but I've got this love for these E30s. I'm not saying they're the best car to drive, but you don't buy one of these because they're the best cars to drive. They've got a good drive to them, but because they're so old now, they're a bit of an effort to drive, as I've mentioned a few times on this video, and I think that's just me getting old, and I prefer the drive on the newer cars and the newer BMs and stuff, but these are a legendary car with a legendary status, and I don't think there's going to be anything out there that will match these. The newer BMs, when they get to this age, will be nowhere near as good, nowhere near as popular, nowhere near as statusy as these things. The E30, more so the E30 3 to 5i manual convertible, is the one. If you've got a bit of extra money to play with, then it's the motorsport convertible. But again, saying that the 3 to 5i Sports are, to this day, are one of the most popular classic cars about. If you can find them, and they warrant the money as well. So, they're just an amazing all-round car. There's nothing out there that I say, again, 
can match one of these cars. Right guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. It was just a brief one. Uh, I thought I'd get it out there, seeing as the weather's nice and got access to this E30, this beautiful E30. Can't just call it any E30, but this beautiful E30. So I'll make a little video just for you guys to see. Some of you probably reminisce from back in the days when you used to have one. I don't know, but hopefully it'll bring back good memories. And yeah, like I said, I hope you've enjoyed the video, guys. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, Performance Lifestyles. Check us out on Instagram, performance underscore lifestyles. And we're on Facebook as well, Performance Lifestyles. Um, and as I've mentioned, you know, we've, we've got 70, 80 odd videos uploaded, majority performance related. So please do check them out. There's a lot of JDM, a lot of Empower, RS, Audis on there so please do check them out we have got plenty of content to come and as per usual stay safe and we will catch you on the next video